Ladies and gentlemen, the horses are on the track and pretty to the post this evening's first race, first half of the Daily Double. Field of eight going to the post. There are no changes. Phillies and Marys claiming pacers, racing one mile. Number one is Mary Midnight. Held by Curtis Best of Malta, Dean Best of Stockport, Ed Ryder trains, Brad Hanner's driving. Two Jiggy Jung Bluegrass, owned by Tom Lovely and Rick McKinney of Ohio. Tom Lovely trains and drives. Three is Mindy Baker, owned by Richard Stevens and Sal Nusser of Columbus. Roy Murphy, the trainer with Dave Miller. Four, Wild Image, owned, trained, and driven by Mark Evers. Five, Scoreboard Paddy, owned by Milt Wilkinson of Hilliard. Richard Randall trains. Jim Shelton drives. Six, Winsome Special, owned and trained by Marlon Smith of Thornville, Darren Mausera. The seven, J.R. Aphrodite, owned, trained, and driven by John Barnes. And from post eight, it's Direct Pride, owned by the J.N.L. Duval Stable, Bayside, New York, and... Franklin of Lexington, Kentucky. Tommy Smith trains. Ryan Holton is in the sonkey. First race, pacing Phillies and Mares. Lining up, moving in. On the back stretch, there they go. And uh, they're off, and it's Mindy Baker from the inside. First for the lead from the far outside. Challenging is Direct Pride. Mid-track third, it's win some special from off the rail in fourth. Mary Midnight, far outside five, comes J.R. Aphrodite. At the rail in sixth, Jiggy Jog Bluegrass. Two lengths in seventh, Wild Image. The yearly trailer in eighth is Scoreboard Patty. Around the first turn and on the front with a lead, it's Mindy Baker. She leads here a length and a half, two inside and second, win some special. And uh, J.R. Aphrodite has hung out the first quarter, the opening uh, panel in uh, 28 and 3. Mary Midnight has a lead, win some special. A bad break there is now trailing, and that gives J.R. Aphrodite a seat behind the leader. And now to the outside, Mary Midnight gets underway in third, inside, and racing fourth is Direct Pride. Jiggy Jog Bluegrass to the outer flow in fifth. At the rail in sixth, Wild Image, then seventh to scoreboard, Paddy. And the trailer now recovering after that break. When some special is trailing eighth, they reach the half 59 and a two. As they make the turn to the back stretch on the front, it's Mindy Baker extending her lead. Now two and a half, three lengths. J.R. Aphrodite is gapping badly in second. Mary Midnight to the outside and three wide. Here comes Jiggy Jog Bluegrass. Scoreboard Paddy is also in the hunt now, racing fifth. And angling to the outside, direct pride around the tiring cover. Into the final turn, Mindy Baker has led every stamp of the mile. Three quarters, 129 and four. But Jiggy Jung Bluegrass, odds on favor, driving up alongside the challenge. The leader at the rail is Mary Midnight and scoreboard Patty into contention fourth. They've lost an eighth of a mile ago. And down the stretch they come. It's Mindy Baker. But on the outside, Jiggy Jung Bluegrass puts a nose in front. And a circling is Wild Image. As they drive the deep stretch, Jiggy Jog Bluegrass. Here comes Wild Image of the outside, Jiggy Jog Bluegrass at the wire. Wild Image was second, tight for show in two minutes and one. Trackside into the winner's circle, unofficial winner, the uh, two horse, Jiggy Jog Bluegrass, 10 year old daughter of Fortune Ritchie. Owned by Tom Lovely and Rick McKinney of Ohio. Tom Lovely, the trainer driver. Win number four for the season. Pacing tonight's mile in two minutes and one fifth. 